All right, guys, and here's the actual um, Fitbit app or whatever. It has up here your sleep, um, your heart rate. See, this shows my heart rate here, and sports when you into sports. So you can see I haven't been into any sports, and uh, I haven't, haven't been wearing when I was sleeping. I did try it one time or whatever. It was pretty cool, but you know, I really take it off my wrist when I go to sleep at night. Um, let's see here. And this here shows the different sports or whatever that you can keep track of. Running, walking, cycling, climbing, yoga, skipping, tennis, basketball. Yeah, I just bought me a basketball. So I will be using this here um, <laughs> coming up. If you guys want me to do a video regarding like what it looks like when it tracks your basketball playing, whatever, I'll do that for you guys. Uh, yeah, man, but this is a really nice watch. Let's go here first, right? And this is, says Join Time Target Sports Unit. Connection problem, feedback, suggestions, settings, and I don't, even, I don't know, I don't even use that stuff, right? That's my name there, um, at the top, right? So let's go here, right? So you have here um, your dial center, right? And this is where you can choose the different faces that you want for your watch. See, and these are some of the different faces I've already used for my watch. This is one I'm using right now, the one that's right here in the center, or whatever, right there, the yellow one. You just seen it on uh, the first part of the video. And I see here, so we have the notification reminder for like, you know, calls, SMS, video chat, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, WhatsApp, you know, all these different settings that, you know, you'll get an alert when this uh, information comes into your phone, right? Alarm clock reminder, sedentary reminder, whatever that is, um, heart rate monitoring, remote photography. You actually can like hit remote photography and shake the phone. And I'll take a picture for you um, if you want to use that option. Uh, switch language. I ain't messing with that. Find device. Firmware. Uh, device version. Restore to factory setting if you need to reset the actual device. So, yeah, man, this is my you know review of the Fitbit that I, re I really like using. I really like wearing. It's the only uh, Fitbit smartwatch that I have. And, um,. It's $45, uh, $44, 45 or 44 I don't know. I'll put a link to Amazon in the description below if you want to actually want to buy the watch. Like I said, I enjoy it. It's been really helpful. Keep your time, you know, especially when I'm traveling or, or walking through the mall or something. I can switch between music and songs and stuff like that uh, as well. And make sure that you like this video and that you subscribe to my channel for, for, for more things that I ordered by from uh, Amazon that you may like. All right. Later.